6.45 in the morning. I'm leaving Khao San Road in Bangkok and I'm moving to Isan. Let me explain. to catch the bus A4 here from Democracy Monument all the way to DMK Airport. If it doesn't show up, I will get a taxi. But uh, I, I took it before and it's very convenient. It's like 30 baht and it goes straight to DMK. So it was a good experience. But let's see if it shows up. So why am I moving to Isan? Well, if you follow the story, unfortunately my girlfriend Ploy, she had a motorbike accident about like a month and a half ago and she hit her uh, head and also her sacral bone so she couldn't walk. We spent like a month in L, in and out of the hospital. It was, it was a real nightmare. And now she moved back to her hometown in Sakon Nakhon in Isan. Mentally, she's doing so much better. Actually, she fully recovered with her brain, which is the most important thing because it was so scary. So mentally, everything is okay, but her sacral bone is still broken, so she still cannot walk. She's still on a wheelchair. So when her mind was okay, I decided to take a, a small break and travel around for for about 10 days but now it's time to go back to her and spend some time with her in Isan and help her slowly to recover and to come back to a, a kind of a normal life but most importantly to come back to to walk again that's why I'm moving to Isan I'm gonna stay with her family in her hometown and I'm gonna try to make some videos and show you the the life there but now it's time to get on the plane actually ask me how I get into airport lounges in Thailand and all around the world. There are so many different ways with airlines, with points, with different credit card, with different partnership and promotion. In my case, I use the crypto.com card. So I bought some crypto.com coin and then I stuck them and I got the card. I'm already into crypto. So I'm very passionate about crypto. I'm very interested in it. Of course, this is not financial advice, but this is the one I use. And by getting this card, they also give me access to all the airport lounges around the world. So that's a, a pretty good deal. If you are interested to discover more about crypto.com and the cryptocurrencies world, I'll put the link down below and you can check it out.
Please be informed that passengers are not allowed to, to consume food and drink on board and are not allowed to queue up for the usage of the battery. So let's comply your result in the collection and be finished by law. Thank you. about to approach the Izan region down below there is Sakon Nakon and you can see the air quality is really bad that is actually pollution as you can see here the air quality is very unhealthy during this time of the year in this part of Thailand the north and the northeast the air quality is really bad this time of the year it's also famous to be the burning season that's why the pollution is so bad and then in the coming months will get better and better hey guys, I made it to Nakhon Sakon in Izan Many people think that Izan is like a place in Thailand, but it's actually a very big region. It's like a big area. It's pretty much the entire east side of Thailand, and it includes a lot of cities, a lot of provinces. In this case, Ploy, she lives in a village near uh, Sakhon Nakhon, or Nakhon Sak Sakhon Nakhon, I always confuse it. But it's the Izan area, it's massive, and includes like Udon Thani, Buriram, Nakhon Panom, Royet, Konken, Ubon Rachatani, etc. It's really, really big. I never been anywhere else except here in Nakhon Sakhon, but I'm really curious to explore more. Let's go meet Ploy now. Oh, here they come. Hi, 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 We made it to our uh, only coffee shop here in the village, which is this one. We come here every morning to get our um, coffee and then bring it back home. Now I came with uh, Natin with the scooter. We got a scooter here. It's just like one minute drive from, from the home. Come here, get a coffee and come back home. Actually, on the way back home, we might stop just to say hi to some nice dogs nearby i really like them we usually we usually feed them in the evening as well they're like street dogs but they are super cute especially one is super cute the coffee here is so cheap just cappuccino americano iced tea ice green tea all kind of coffee is just 20 baht extremely cheap in Bangkok, you can pay for the same coffee, maybe 100, 120 baht. Easy. The dog house. Oh, here it is. Hello, doggito. He's, oh, oh. He's sleeping. This is actually the house of the of Ploy's Hanko. He lives here, and there are these dogs, stray dogs, that are always here. Sabadi cup. Sabadi cup. Hello. <laughs> Doggy, you're so sweet. You're so cute, man. So cute, so cute. And this one? <laughs> this one's scared. <laughs> Hehehe. <laughs> 
I think he's scared. <laughs> he's scared of the dogs. But he's so sweet. He's so sweet. He's so sweet. Oh, first time he make it cuddle. These are my new favorite dogs and there, there is another one there but he's very scared of human he just come to eat and then he run away it's right there let me see if i can show you he's also very scared of human you see he's already running away hey. so this is the life in the village very sabai sabai cuddling dogs feeding them drinking coffee and hanging out with Natin. Sabai sabai, sabai sabai. So thank you guys so much for watching this video from Bangkok all the way to Isan in Sakon Nakon. I hope you enjoy this sabai sabai lifestyle in the village of Thailand. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below what do you think and I will definitely see you in the next video. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Got one coffee for me, hot coffee, green tea for Natin, and the iced tea for the monk there. And this is the mama ploy. This is the father of ploy, and this is the mama. Yeah, there is a monk living in front of us we just bought him iced tea